Hello friends, welcome to my channel. I am back here with the Cyber Olympiad Practice Questions Part 5. Hope you like my previous videos. So I am here with the new practice lesson test. Hey friends, write down your answers on a paper and check your score at the end of the video. Please subscribe my channel for more educational videos and the subscription is totally free. Let's start with the first question. The first mechanical calculating machine was made by guess. Guess your answer and write down on the paper. Yes, the correct answer is C. Blaise Pascal. Our next question is, which programming language is much in vogue among users of microcomputers? Guess your answer and write down on your paper. Yes, Fort. Fort is the correct answer. Option D. Our next question is, what is required when more than one person uses a central computer at the same time? Guess your answer? Yes, correct answer is terminal. Option D. Yes, let's start with the fourth question. Which of the following resistors is used to keep track of address of the memory location where the next instruction is located? Yes, guess your answer? Correct answer is program counter. Next question. One nibble is equal to? Correct answer is 4 bits. Yes, next question. In which area of primary storage section are the intermediate processing result held temporarily? Guess your answer. The correct answer is working storage space. Next question. The original ASCII code used dash bit of each byte reserving that last bit for error checking. Guess your answer? Yes, 7 is the correct answer. Which of the following terms is the most closely related to main memory? The correct answer is temporary. The computer industry uses prefixes of Greek origin to measure large amount of data. Which term describes 1024 bytes? Yes, guess your answer. Correct answer is kilobyte. Option A. Which kind of storage device can be carried around? Guess your answer. The correct answer is flash drive that can be carried around. And this is your scorecard. If you gave 10 correct answers, marvelous. 9 correct answers, excellent. 8 correct answers, good. 7 or less than that, please practice again. So friends, more educational videos and MCQs, please subscribe my channel and the subscription is totally free.